In this video, we are going to see how to create image filters from sampled sounds. This has many applications, vocoding and convolution effects, but also as the starting point for creating rhythmic effects that you will apply to pads and other sustained sounds. On the canvas, I've already loaded an image filter created from a spoken word sample. I've loaded into the sample editor a slow string progression. Let's hear the filter applied to the sound. Welcome to medicine. Here is a vast creative space. And now let's take a look at a filter that I derived from the first one applying techniques that I'm about to show you. And now let's hear these two filters applied to an acoustic guitar sample. Alright, let's take a look and see how these filters were created. Okay, we start by opening up the sound that we're going to use as the filter, which is the Animedicine speech sound. Welcome to medicine. I go ahead and I put that into stereo mode. And since I've already set up the canvas with the tuning reference and the width I want, all I have to do is click on the Analyze Spectrum button. Let's go ahead and open up our guitar sample and let's hear what Welcome what we've got. Here is a vast creative space where your two most I'm going to go ahead and use the contrast and luminance medicine. tool. Here is a vast creative space where your two most precious senses Welcome to medicine. Here is a vast creative space. Now I want to go ahead and use the quantize tool. I'm going to try 16. I'm option clicking. Yeah, that's a little bit more than I want. So I'm going to go ahead and enter 8. And again, I option click on quantize. Okay, I like that. I'm going to set offset to wrap around. I'm going to drag to select part of the canvas. And now I'm just going to drag to the right to offset that portion of the canvas. I'm going to offset different parts of the canvas by different amounts. And what that will do is it will preserve some of the vocal timbre, but it will it will make the words unrecognizable. Now I want to add some stereo characteristics, so I'm going to go ahead and edit just the left channel. And I'm going to click on the attack tool, which will sharpen the attacks there. Now I want to go ahead and edit the right channel, set the grid filter to 32, add a little bit of right channel echo, and there you are. 